free spirits, lyrics, the song is self-care. Self-care is the action behind self-love. Dare to treat yourself fair. Let's discuss what self-care looks like. It's taking a shower and brushing your teeth despite feeling le depressed and lethargic. Don't regress with hygiene. It's allowing yourself to rest instead of always aiming to be productive. Rest allows you to perform your best. Take on your tests like a boss. Toss the junk food in the trash. Sugar will make you crash mentally, physically, and emotionally. Habitually clean your space. If you're distressed, wash your face with cold water. That's a DBT skill. Fill your glass with water. Hydration is a huge energy booster. Start the titration of all media. They're feeding your brain bacteria. Their criteria is to manipulate you to pursue their agenda with biased propaganda. Learn to meditate. There are several meditation methods. Guided meditation is my favorite, as well as contemplation meditation. Self-medicating is polluting your mind, redefining your brain chemistry towards mental illness. Find coping skills outside of drugs and alcohol. Shrug off the weight of yesterday. Today is a new day. You are capable of restarting your day at any time. Kickstart with self-care. Everyone can create a toolbox, debate your current skills to cope, do the drill inspecting each one, dub them as healthy or unhealthy, are they wealthy and true self-love? Using dope to cope will bring you to the end of your rope. I lost all hope when I coped with dope, hit rock bottom's basement, had to do replacement in all aspects like rehab. Replacement behaviors are endless to de deplace your toxic traits. Use hobbies to bait your passion. Self-care is more than veggies and water. It's about learning to let loose and allowing yourself to have fun. It's okay to recluse and solitary as long as your alone time is full of quality. Unhealthy and unbalanced ordinary days don't create a great life. Get out of your comfort zone. Grab the phone and call a friend. Spend some money and go to a comedy club. There is a sub for burnout. It's called New Adventures. Go about new ways. Venture the world. Curiously, seriously, learn a balance being outside and inside. I've heard a pastor say, the only way to grow is to go outside of your comfort zone. DBT, aka Dialectical Behavior Therapy, refers to that as doing opposite action. Exaggerate the fraction of you that feels motivation to change. Fill the wide range of innovation. Equip your toolbox with skills that will actually work for you. Google search coping skills. Check out Pinterest. Spark your childlike interest for new experiences. If your interest doesn't exceed mild, move on to the next idea. Find the best tools for you. A few of mine are reading different spiritual texts, checking out activities at the local park and rec, writing songs and making music, nothing wrong with sex and masturbation, hibernation and nest in my bed with a book, cook a yummy healthy meal. These are just some of my coping techniques. Self-care is meant to provide overall wellness. That means there are different techniques for mental wellness, spiritual ritual, physical fitness, emotional intelligence. All are relevant to self-care. So make sure to eat your veggies, greet each day with your values and principles, discipline your emotions for stability, pray and meditate for inner tranquility, flex your abilities to work for you, master your personal liabilities that hinder you, avoid self-pity and neg negative attitude benders, allow yourself to do what gives you joy, go for a walk in the sunlight, breathe in deep the fresh air, talk out your problems with the loved ones problem solved obstacles 
that prevent your best effort. Resolve to treat yourself like you'd want to see your best friend behave. Be brave as you build new routine routines. Do some field work and explore the world. Be spontaneous for miscellaneous mischievousness. Never know where the road will bring you. Everything new is a beginning discovery. Reactionary is brand new to you. Pursue new dreams. Discern carefully the team in your corner. If they aren't clapping when you succeed, don't feed any further into the relationships. Achieve greatness surrounded by other natural leaders. Factual advice to thrive, so vibe in self-love. Dare to overcome your inner resistance. Practice re relentless persistence for a balanced routine. Being healthy in an ordinary way makes for extraordinary days. The way to unlock your ideal self, shock the world with your destiny, own your wellness testimony. Self-care is meant to be refreshing in times when the world is so depressing. Accept the quest, invest in self-love. Self-care is the action behind self-love. Dare to treat yourself fair. Let's discuss what self-care looks like. It's taking a shower and brushing your teeth despite feeling depressed and lethargic. Don't regress with hygiene. It's allowing yourself to rest instead of always aiming to be productive. Rest allows you to perform your best. Take on your tests like a boss. Toss the junk food in the trash. Sugar will make you crash mentally, physically, and emotionally. Habitually clean your space. If you're distressed, wash your face with cold water. That's a DBT skill. Fill your glass with water. Hydration is a huge energy booster. Start the titration of all media. They're feeding your brain bacteria. Their criteria is to manipulate you to pursue their agenda with biased propaganda. Learn to meditate. There are several meditation methods. Guided meditation is my favorite, as well as contemplation meditation. Self-medicating is polluting your fine. Redefining your brain chemistry towards mental illness. Find coping skills outside of drugs and alcohol. Shrug off the weight of yesterday. Today's a new day. You are capable of restarting your day at any time. Kickstart with self-care. Self-care is the action behind self-love.